world Muay Thai champion, now shooting for world title number two from the land of the rising sun, they call her the Princess of Pain. She is Sachio Shibata. Mark the Hammer, Sachio Shibata comes to Australia with huge wraps, and not only those ones around her wrist. Well, I tell you what, Michael, she is a very accomplished fighter, and she is certainly going to uh, be a, a very, very tough opponent for the late minute uh, call up, Bullet Williams. So Shio Shibata will step up against our own Karen Bullet Williams, stepping in for the injured Laura Skinner, and this one for the ISKA World Women's Muay Thai title. Karen the Bullet Williams! Oh, it's time to raise the roof. Being led to the ring by the legendary Ian Jacobs. She is Karen the Bullet Williams. Mark the Hammer, Karen Williams on the edge of the dream. Can she do it? Can she beat the world renowned Sachio Shibata to secure the ISKA world title? Well, as she said to me in the uh, in the free fight, Michael, uh, you know, world title, you've got to take it. Doesn't matter if it's on short notice or whatever. These opportunities don't come along too often, and uh, it's her it's her chance to shoot for her dream. Karen Williams is living the dream, about to hop into centre ring. The traditional flowers around the neck of the Mong Kong of the Muay Thai fighter. Let's go to ring announcer Andy Raymond. Ladies and gentlemen, this bout for the ISKA Women's World Flyweight Kickboxing title. We are scheduled on this occasion for five two-minute rounds. Introducing first in this international contest from Japan. She weighed in at an even 49 kilos. A record, 22 fights, 12 wins, 6 wins via way of knockout. From the Beilong Gym, the current IKKC Muay Thai World Champion. Ladies and gentlemen, the Princess of Pain, Sachio Shibata. Across the ring. Fighting out of the bullet tie boxing, Ian Jacobs as her trainer. Weighing in at 49.5 kilograms, she has 10 wins and three knockouts. On her record book, the hometown girl, Karen the Bullet Williams. That's gloves. Five, two minutes, yes, one minute break. Okay, knee to head, no elbows, okay? No elbows, to your corners. Well, the first round underway here between Sachia Shibata from Japan and Carrot Bullet Williams from Australia. Look out for the leg kicks and the hand combinations of Sachia Shibata from Japan. She already holds the IKKC world title, going after the ISKA world title here tonight. Well, Michael, we uh, have uh, been informed earlier that uh, Sachia Shibata is uh, coming into this fight with a couple of cracked ribs, or she's been training up with a couple of cracked ribs. So it'll be interesting to see how she guards that, uh, that injury during this fight and whether uh, Karen really rolls in those uh, body shots or body kicks if that does affect her uh, performance at all. Comments there from the former Australian Cruiserweight Muay Thai champion, the Hammer Mark Castanini ringside with myself, Michael Chavello. We're coming to you from Jupiter's on the Gold Coast. Shibata moves forward now. She wins the Best Trunks of the Night Award, the Princess of Pain, also the Princess of Ring Fashion right here at the moment. And great to see the little Woody Woodpecker on her shorts there, Hammer. Yeah, Michael, uh, only you'd notice that, but yes. <laughs> Shishio Shibata is... Uh, Certainly a tough, a tough oh, fighter. Nice right hand there from Shibata. Caught Karen Williams napping. The slight height and reach advantage going the way of our very own bullet, Karen Williams. Williams in the trusty hands of Ian Jacobs in her corner. Shibata has not relented on her so far in this round. She has been all over Karen Williams. Continues to come forward and put the pressure on the Aussie. Well, the Japanese have one victory from one earlier on tonight. When Kato Masaki beat Shannon Forrester, can they make it two from two? Karen Bullitt-Williams got other ideas. She came in here on short notice, Hammer, replacing the injured Laura the Storm Skinner. Well, that shows a lot of heart. Karen Williams, uh, the bullet, she's certainly uh, risen to the occasion. And win, lose or draw, I take my, uh, my hat off to this lady for taking this fight against a very, very tough uh, Japanese uh, female fighter. 
A oh, beautiful leg kick there from Sachia Shabata. I thought she was going to try and wind up a spinning back fist into the first round of action. How do you see it, Hammer? Well, even first up round, but Sachia Shabata certainly the aggressor in that one. Karen, uh, a little bit on the back foot, but nevertheless uh, mobile. Having a look at uh, Shabata, just uh, going to the corner now, coming up with the game plan, and we'll see uh, how we uh, how they come out in the second. Once again, you see uh, Shabata just big right hand caught Karen Williams there, put her into the red corner. And uh, Karen just uh, reassesses, guards up again, and uh, gets ready to uh, to keep her off with that front kick that she fires out right there. Mostly time technique, and brings in the round kick. She's got to watch uh, watch out for holding onto the rope, so you're not allowed to do that. Uh, Karen Williams, she's got to let go of the rope when she kicks. Don't overload, sharp. Don't use your energy, just keep it sharp, okay? Inside leg kick, bang, bang. Stay just out of reach, when she misses, leg kick up, okay? Club of Powerhouse Ian Jacobs in the corner of Karen Bullet Williams to tell her to watch out for the leg kicks of Sashia Shabata. She is a leg kicker hammer going to work on that lead thigh of Karen Williams. Well, the Japanese fighters are renowned for having the big leg kicks. They come from, uh, you know, most of them, 90% of them come from a traditional uh, karate uh, background and uh, they're very well schooled in those uh, kicking techniques. Into the second round of action, the World Isca title on the line here. Knee in the midsection there from Karen Williams. The knees really haven't come into play so far in this fight. It is on the modified tyre rules, of course. No elbows, knees only. Good outside thigh kick there again from Shibata. Then launches one to the right rib cage of Karen Williams. Williams just leaning on the ropes and trying to work her own lead round kick to the ribs of Shibata. One-two punch combination then downstairs again. The Japanese Shibata turning it on here in the second stanza. Karen Williams just ties up Shibata, who tries to work those knees in the midsection. The ankle heavily strapped of Karen Williams to hammer that right ankle, maybe carrying an injury downstairs. Well, she's certainly uh, looking after it for some reason. And Shibata now just go attacking and attacking and attacking that lead leg of, uh, of uh, Karen Williams. The Aussie girl uh, taking a bit of a battering in the leg department. I tell you what, let's put Shibata into a little bit of perspective. The Japanese opponent that Laura Skinner defeated for her world title has been twice defeated by this woman, Shibata. Shibata goes to the canvas there after a succession from Karen Williams. And Williams starting to get a little bit gritty now, showing that pure Australian determination. Still up psychic there from Shibata Hammer. It's uh, certainly plain to see the uh, Japanese fighter is going to go for that big rear round kick to the legs of Karen Williams. Karen has to uh, check it and work possibly her right hand straight off it because uh, Shibata is leaning in a little bit for that leg kick and her head is in range of a right cross. Well, Sashia Shibata is the real deal. She is serving up the leg kicks on Karen Williams so far. There's the high right round kick up to the head. Luckily, Karen Williams had built a defensive wall. Well, goes so downstairs and Williams checks the low kick. She has with the right hand. Here comes Sashia Shibata. Williams forced to cover up in the neutral corner now. Rompar almost about to step in. He does step in. Saves Karen Williams. Well, Sashia Shibata is possibly the best female fighter I've seen, Michael. She's wow. absolutely awesome. Will Karen Williams want to go on with it? Hammer spinning her mouth down as she walks back to the corner. Well, I tell you what, we'll, uh, I don't think uh, Karen uh, is there for it. She's not looking uh, too confident at this point, and she's in a bit of bother. How good is Sashia Shibata, Hammer? Well, she's just pure aggression. She knows she's got to look after her ribs if she is indeed carrying that rib injury. So she's not letting uh, Karen have a, have a chance of getting a crack at her. She's just uh, attacking all the way. Big breath, Karen. Big breath. Big breath. Wait up. in the corner, Ian Jacobs there, consulting with referee Ron Parr, maybe the ringside physician coming in to take a look. The banged up left leg of Karen Williams. It's up to her. Ah, fuck! You're looking smart! You are! You are looking smart! Hang on, you're ahead. Hang on, I think uh, there's, there's that much confusion in the corner. If the Japanese girl comes out, Karen uh, is really not there. You can see they've got a, a ventilant ready. She's obviously suffering from uh, maybe a bit of a chest cold with a uh, couple maybe with her asthma and uh, probably not a good thing for uh, Karen to continue.
Out, out, out. If you can't continue, I'll give you like 10 seconds right now. Let's go, girl. All right? No, you're going to give me some more water, mate. Ian Jacob slips in the mouth guard, and Karen Bullet Williams is going to answer the bell, folks. Well, she's shaking her head and saying she can't do it. That's, uh, you know, probably not a good sign. Well, definitely not a good sign. And the Japanese girls see that now, so she's going to be pumped even more. Here comes Shoshia Shibata again, launching those wicked round kicks. Switches stance to southpaw stance now. Back to orthodox stance, Sashia Shibata. Looks for the gut munching front kick, maybe the inside fire kick. Shibata ready to pounce on it, goes downstairs to the outside left fire again. Inside fire kick, didn't quite find the mark there for Karen Williams. Williams is taking a lot of punishment now in this round. Shibata moves forward once again, tags with a right hand, left hand combination. Front kick again there from Shibata, Williams just forces her off, but Karen Williams just doesn't want to be there. Well, Shibata, absolute thrashing machine. She's just relentless in her attacks. Shibata does not relent, but Bullet Williams taking a nice uppercut under the draw. Oh, Shibata smacks it there for high right now. Kick. Williams in all sort of bother. She's in a world of hurt. Well, Shibata not even getting into the grapple here. She's just uh, content to, uh, to kickbox Karen Williams. She doesn't want to grapple with her and tie up with her knees. Bullet is shaking her head. She's hanging onto the rope. Rob Taylor it. steps in. That's it's all right. over. It's a TKO victory by stoppage to Sashia Shibata. Well, oh, Sashia Shibata, the women's world flyweight champion. There it is. I tell uh, you what, two and zero to Japan. What a quality world champion, Sashia Shibata. One of the best female fighters I've seen in a long, long time, Sashia Shibata. Certainly put it together well. Aggression all the way. Hands and feet. Work the technique. A, a, a treat, and uh, a well-deserved uh, champion she is. Once again, we see Karen just uh, fighting for her survival, and uh, as I said, she showed a lot of heart. Obviously, she wasn't well, but uh, she tried to put on a show for the crowd. And uh, she exhibited some great technique, Bullet. I was very impressed with her in the, uh, in the first and second round. She put up a bit of a show, but uh, the Japanese uh, contender was always just too classy and uh, too switched on for Karen here tonight. Karen, uh, if she would have taken this fight, given the uh, full preparation time and uh, been in the right frame of mind, it could have been a totally different story. And uh, as I said, I take my hat off to the Aussie for uh, actually hopping in and helping the promoters out with this fight because a lot of people uh, came here to see this fight here tonight um, with the Japanese women, women's uh, world champion. Let's go to Andy Raymond. Ladies and gentlemen, a TKO in round number three, your winner and ISKA women's flyweight kickboxing champion, Sergio Shabata.